Hey, what's up, you guys? It's Caboose bringing you another Spider-Man PS4 video, and today is the day that a lot of the community has been waiting for for a very long time. The update we've all been wanting is finally here. New Game Plus has arrived. Now, before we jump into this, I wanted to ask you guys, of course, if you could leave a like rating on the video as it shows your support, and I'd really appreciate it. So if you could leave a like, that would be awesome. And with that said, well, let's just jump right into this. So Earlier in the week, we were told that apparently New Game Plus was going to be coming out on the 16th, I believe, or the 17th. It was just supposed to happen a couple of days ago, but Insomniac then once again delayed it and said, hey, that's not true, it's still coming soon. We did have confirmation it was going to drop before the DLC, and well, today, just out of nowhere, the update with New Game Plus has launched. So, update 1.07 and 1.08 have both combined and been put out so if you go onto your playstation right now and check for an update for spider-man ps4 you will see that there is one available and when you download it and it's completed its download then you will have a new game plus and the ultimate difficulty available to you now all the new features that are coming here in this update of course we have new game plus we have the ultimate difficulty there's going to be two new trophies that are tied to both of those so there's one where you complete new game plus and you know you get a trophy for that and then there's one where you complete the game on the ultimate difficulty where you'll get another trophy for that they've also added the ability to rotate layers in photo mode and added new frames and stickers to photo mode and then they also added a shortcut option to trigger photo mode via the left directional button so this is some awesome updates here for photo mode i'm very happy to see these because it has been pretty frustrating that there are some photos that i've always wanted to make but because you can't rotate those stickers i wasn't able to do them and then of course i'm also excited to jump in and see what new features are available to us with photo mode i'm just happy overall that insomniac has continued to support this mode so far after the release of the game it's just such a great thing that they're doing with photo mode and it's one of the most fun things about spider-man ps4 now although it's pretty self-explanatory and really straightforward i did want to show you guys here a quick little tutorial on how to create a new game plus save slot it's very very easy all you got to do is hover over one of your completed games so when you've beaten the game and you have that save slot in which you've beaten the game you should see a prompt when you hover over it that says you can create a new game plus slot and then that will be at the bottom you just got to press square once you do that one of your save slots will now be filled with a new game plus save slot and then you can go ahead and click that and start up new game plus now if you've beaten the game six times like some of the crazy dedicated fans out there i'm assuming you're probably going to have to overwrite those saves to make room for the new game plus save slot but i don't know for sure on that as i haven't completed the game six times but nevertheless it seems that probably will be the case so if you are one of those crazy dedicated fans you're gonna have to get rid of one of those save slots to make room for new game plus but overall, this is just really exciting news. We have been waiting for this mode for so long now, and as we are at the home stretch for the DLC launch, it is great that we have something to hold us over until that time, having New Game Plus, having the ultimate difficulty, and then, of course, all the new features added to photo mode now there are a ton of other bug fixes that have been added in here through these patch notes and if you want to read the entire patch notes they're going to be linked in the description but the one other thing that i wanted to point out was that they tuned the friendly combat difficulty based on player feedback so although there are some people out there who think that the game was a little too easy even when playing on the spectacular difficulty there are a ton of people out there as well who felt that the friendly difficulty wasn't very friendly so insomniac has tuned it a little bit to make it a little bit more easy for those players so that they don't have too difficult of a time playing through the game on the easiest difficulty which i think is a good thing you know there's a lot of people who just want to relax and run through the game without too many challenges or without too many issues and just want to enjoy it and that's it so that's totally fine and if that's something you want to do just play on the friendly difficulty it seems that they've tuned it to make it a little less challenging and a little more easy going but that's it. That's all the news that I got for you guys today. Jump in, get on Spider-Man PS4, and play through New Game Plus. I know we've all been waiting for it, but now I want to hear from you guys in the comments. What do you think about New Game Plus? Are you excited for it? Let me know your thoughts. And with that said, I'm Caboose. And once again, if you could leave a like rating on the video, it shows your support, and I would really appreciate it. And you can click on screen to make your way to one of the other videos on the channel, or you can click my logo to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Please Follow me on Instagram and Twitter and like me on Facebook. Those links are in the description. Drop a like if you enjoyed. Leave a comment if you have an opinion. And subscribe if you're new. See you guys later.